going on better with this junior has been coming to you live i am a navy desert storm 100 percent permanent total veteran that's coming to you live today to talk about the number one gift that every injured veteran should have for christmas and that gift is smart money there's two types of money out there there's dumb money and then there's smart money let's just talk about dumb and smart money dumb money is when you're earning income and taxed to death all right and I know this is about VA disability, but you have to have some type of financial IQ to be able to value what a high value claim means to you and your family. OK, you're going out the door for earned income is being taxed heavily by the state and heavily by your federal. If you live in a state with tax, a state income tax. Now, if you got a smart watch, smart TV, a smart phone, you got it to be more to be more intelligent, to be more informed. Right. So smart money will have you to be more informed, more intelligent about financial education because most of you, the, the, the age bracket that I'm talking to right now are from the ages of 35 to 64 and you got retirement on your mind. And if you're injured in the military right now, you need to be thinking about smart money, just like you have the latest smart TV, the latest smart watch, the latest smartphone. Some of you have invested thousands of dollars into your smart TV and not willing to invest thousands of dollars to smart income from VA disability. Why is that income smart? Well, there's two reasons why I call VA disability compensation a smart money product. It's because number one, it's tax free. You cannot go outside your house legally and earn one cent without it being taxed. Am I right? Absolutely. So smart money is tax free money. You know, the second thing I love about VA disability, why I call it smart money is because every year you get an inflation increase. And this year you're going to get 5.9 percent increase. If you log on to VA uh, benefits.gov, they already have the new rates listed for your percentage. And at 100 percent veteran alone, I was getting paid thirty one forty six. This year, all month this year, every single month. Now, December 31st, it's going to be $33.22, uh, about $178, close to $200 in increase. Now, my question to you, veteran, that's injured, no matter what era you're coming from, from the Vietnam era, the Desert Storm era, or the current era, we just got back from Afghanistan. What would you rather have right now, smart money that's tax-free, and adjust for inflation every single year or going out there busting your tail every month for earned income, which is taxed every every day, every pay period, every two weeks without your permission and not being trusted to do the right thing with your money. They take it first. What would you rather do? if you had to choose? But most of you are still working. And I understand that. But we're talking about retirement years. If you are injured, this is going to come up. Number one, cash flow. Number two, health care costs. With VA disability, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to take care of both of those issues. A lot of times when you, I'm doing consultations with veterans, they are at their retirement age or approaching their retirement age, and it's on their mind. They've been ramrodded by the VA and misinformation from v, uh, VSOs and attorneys and veteran advocate. They're out there waiting in this water, just dog paddling. You have the number one gift, the New Life Insider program, to help you get to where you need to go, from point A to point B. If your goal is to get to a high value claim at 80 to 100% of smart money, what is smart money? Tax-free money and adjusted for inflation. I got one question to ask you right now. Your money that you're getting every single two weeks, is it tax-free? Is it adjusted for inflation? There's more people that are investing into gadgets and stuff for this holiday right now, and they won't even enroll into the New Life Insider program, that our program is $1,000. You'll have a $1,500 cell phone, $2,000 cell phone, $3,000 TV, your smartwatch is worth $2,000, and you won't even invest into smart money. Now, what I call that that's called financial illiteracy. If you know the value of money, you would take this time out this Christmas holiday, set out time 
to do a consultation to learn about how you can acquire your smart money. Now, here's the things I want to go over with you with filing for that smart money. There's a few applications, just like when you served in the military, that you got to fill out correctly. All right. Now, if you're trying to do a service connection, to get service connection for the first time, it's called an original claim. You're going to use 21-526E to get to that smart money. If you're like me, you would like to have some smart money. And if you like this video about smart money, hit me a like, hit me a comment, and also subscribe to the channel to get more videos. All right, if you want to do an increased rating to get some more smart money, you at 50%, but you want to get 70%. You at 70%, you want to get 100%. You want to file the 526EZ again, VA form 21-526EZ. If you're looking for a permanent and total rating. Some of you are already at 100%, but you're going to get reevaluated up until the age of 55, and you want permanent total, even if you're over the age of 55, and you want that permanent total rating. You're going to send in the application 21-526EZ. Now, permanent total is going to lock a lot of things, dependent education assistance for your spouse or your children when they turn the age of 18. You have an... Um, uh, in some states, it's going to unlock property tax exemption. There's a whole host of benefits of being permanent total. You can fly MAC flights all around the world. I mean, for pennies on the dollar, something like $10, $15, flying into Sigonella, Sicily. I'm, I was in the Navy. We fly into a road of Spain. We fly into a lot of places, but MAC flights, I mean, access to the bases if you haven't done 20 years. It's so much benefit to this, but we're just going to talk about these forms right now. We'll save that for another video. Now, if you've been denied before, okay, you've had a denial letter recently, you got two things to do. A high-level review to get a GS-13 to look at it, that's normally a supervisor, or you're going to have a, a new and relevant evidence. Well, either way, they carry a different form. The 20-0995, again, VA form, 20 0 995 is the form if you have new and relevant information. Why do you need that? Because if you enroll into the Life Insider program as a gift to yourself for the holiday and you're trying to get service connected for something you were denied for and get a high value claim, you're going to use 20-0995 because the new and relevant information is going to be the new information from our uh, certified doctors, board certified uh, surgeons that we have in the network. For instance, uh, let's say you got denied for PTSD. Okay. Uh, you didn't get service connected for it. They saw the injury in the service. Uh, they see that you're going to the VA currently. You've been diagnosed and you got prescriptions, right? But that happened back in 1992. I'm just giving an example. My example. Okay. Now, the law states that you have to have all three elements of service connection. What are they? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to keep hammering this to you. Number one, do you have a current diagnosis? They want to know, are you currently being seen by a psychiatrist or psychologist for your mental disorder? I don't care if it's PTSD, major depressive disorder, schizophrenia, mood disorder, chronic pain disorder, whatever mental disorder you have or whatever disability you have, you better have a current current uh, diagnosis within the last 12 months. That's element number one. Number two, you better show us you came in the, mer in the military with this problem that's called pre-service, but once you got in the military, you start going to the sick call about that service because it got aggravated. That's a pre-service event. Or in service. It happened, boom, in service from 1991-95 in my case. Thirdly, you can have something aggravated, something want to exasperate it because of your current disability. Let me give you an example. Broken nose, still broken. It's obstructing my passageway. When I go to sleep, I'm not breathing properly through my nose, so I have to breathe through my mouth. That is a disability called sleep apnea, okay? Now, that was aggravated. That's a secondary claim. Now, that don't mean anything. If you're getting a CPAP machine issued from the VA, even today, and... You saw the broken nose way back in 1992 when it happened. What do we have to do now? We have to satisfy the third element. The third element says, if you've been out the military more than 12 months, you got a 12-month window to get it together from when you separate. If you don't, you got to go this route. And sadly mistaken, most veterans, 
don't know this. They go through the process and throw against the wall just because somebody told them. They just throw it up against the wall and close their eyes. And they get mad and surprised when they get a decision letter in the mail, not service connected. You're like, what do I mean? Man, I, I sent in the information. I saw the injury in the military. Uh, I'm being seen by the VA, right? I'm going to the hospital right now. Most of you are, feeling, are, 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 are finding yourself in that category. But you're not meeting element number three, ladies and gentlemen. Element three is going to knock you out. You know, LL Cool J had a song, Mama Said Knock You Out. Well, that CMP examiner and that VA radar is going to knock you out because you do not follow Title 38, Part 4. This is the gift that you need to have. Not a smartwatch, not a smart TV, not a gift on this planet is worth more than smart money, tax-free and inflation-proof. Am I correct? You can have opportunity after opportunity to, to look at. This takes stress off of you. Your housing costs, your transportation costs, your utilities. There's no longer stress when it comes to finances. You can look at things you really want to do that gives you pleasure than working a job that you do not like just for the paycheck. So the third element to satisfy service connection, it states that you got to have an outside physician, that means non-VA physician, to be examine you, that new diagnosis, the injury in the military, and make a determination that you are suffering right now in 2021 as of this recording from that same injury that happened way back when in 1992. I'm just giving an example of my situation. You mean to tell, because the VA is going to say, you mean to tell me, Junius, you want me to believe that in 2021, you're suffering right now from something that happened in 1992? Why did it take you so long to come up with this situation? Why did it take you so long to bring it to our attention? I didn't know. Undiagnosed. So this physician that I've seen, and as well as your physician at the VA, because I went to y'all and told y'all what's going on. But I went on my own to my private physician and got an op a medical opinion with medical rationale according to Title 38, Part 4. This is the paperwork. And then I went a step further and I followed New Life Inside a program, found some court cases from the Veterans Appeals Court. The appellate court means somebody got denied at the lower level at the regional office. They got denied with a high level review or they got denied with a new and relevant evidence, and it went all the way up to the appeals court in D.C. And so now you have a veteran law judge that has adjudicated on the same identical case that you're presenting in front of the VA. I'm going to teach you how to look for those cases because if we put up a good fight in the beginning and let them know we're not playing, we got court cases where three veteran law judges have approved three different cases dealing with Sleep apnea secondary to uh, PTSD. Sleep apnea secondary to this. Or sleep apnea secondary to deviated septum. Or migraines secondary to tinnitus. See, we're going to put a blueprint together. If you value tax-free, inflation-proof income, you wouldn't make the excuse and say, I don't have the money. You wouldn't make the excuse and say, I need to speak to my spouse. Because most spouses, most marriages are fighting over what? Money. What's the number one reason why marriages fail? Money. I don't know this has nothing to do with VA disability. But you got to be honest with yourself. What gift would you rather have for Christmas? Tax-free income that's inflation proof? Over $40,000 a year coming into that household tax-free that you can touch. Because a lot of people talk about their gross income. And that's exactly what it is. Gross. Because that net income is not the same as that gross. This can free you guys up. Being injured and serving the greatest country in the world has been the greatest gift that you can ever have. Because now you have an unfair advantage to change your family's future. You have an unfair advantage to change your family's legacy. You have an unfair advantage that every kid in your house can go to college. You have an unfair advantage to not pay taxes on that money that somebody else is paying taxes on. Yeah, I said it. 
most everybody else that's paying taxes are funding disability. $91 billion are being paid out in compensation every single year to people like you that are injured. But you will never know that if you wimp out and make excuses and not enroll into the New Life Inside a program, uh, program. If you are sick and tired of making excuses and you want to take action, I suggest you do one thing. Stop right now, log on to newlifeveterans.com, request a free consultation. Let's find out if there's an opportunity to get you a high value claim to get more smart money. Two types of money, smart money and dumb money. Dumb money is earned income being taxed to death. Smart money is passive money that you're not working for that's tax free and inflation proof. Thank you so much for watching this video. And if this has helped you and inspired you to take action today, give me a like, give me a comment, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you at the bank and at the top.